okay so whenever you come over to your blogspot website and the templates you got off from like these websites like free website and you wanted to remove this footer uh like when you go like if you press ctrl f and if you go for the searching for copyright and there you come for this uh, thing and now if like uh, this says sora templates.com but if you want to like remove this and write like something uh, if uh, i say something like uh, this and uh, if I have to some like uh, write something like this, what the what this does after saving is that uh, it redirects you to the different website. Like I show you after saving it, like it's saved now. And if I go for the my website and reload it, you would be able to see that copyright uh, below has changed, but now it redirects me to the other website. So how you can do is that I'll just show you. Uh, yep, just have to close that, and you have to come back to your. Uh, uh, what do you say what is this yeah uh, HTML editor so you come right to the copyright area write whatever you want to write and in, st in like if you don't want to like uh, er yeah, uh, wait a second yeah if you don't want to like remove the HRF you can also just put that in so what you can do is uh, you can just uh, yeah i'll just write this only because i don't need anything anymore so that is just uh, the thing and what you have to do for that redirect to don't happen is what generally i did before was before finding this solution was i also did like sora templates i searched for it and i just go on removing all those urls but that's not the case guys because in this html uh there is a encrypted script right here so i would show you how how do you can find it and also how you can just uh, uh, delete it so that it would be like uh, easier for you guys to uh, change it without redirection so what you can see is uh, so see these scripts those say like those doesn't say blah 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 like there are words uh, replace and stuff this looks like a actual code and over here this looks like an encrypted script but there are also multiple encrypted scripts in one HTML file so what you have to do is uh, if ever you see these files don't ever try to delete these also you can just uh, remove all the Sora templates name from the file that would be right good idea for you guys so what you have to do is close this one uh, I would be able to do it from the top so what you have to do is find this pagination scripts you can also do it from like uh, control F uh, pagination scripts above that this is the script this is not an encrypted script you have to find an encrypted script so this is script is simple you don't have to do anything for that come over here uh, close this script and now you see this is the encrypted script that is doing the function of uh, what do you say uh, it's doing for the uh, redirection purpose so what you have to do is uh, I will show you how to delete it just in a moment first of all I'll show you what it says so if you copy this and if you write down in your browser de js and uh, click on the first link and copy paste that uh, encrypted script uh, uh, after the semicolon till the semicolon and just auto decode it it will just choose it what's happening so now you see this is the thing that it says sora template and it redirects you to the locations for the sora templates if it doesn't found like it see at my uh, at my content and window.location.hrf so it doesn't uh, like you know opens up it in a new new page it opens like in the windows itself so that is all this function like it uh, matches and replace it with other stuff so that's how it does things so what you have to do is you have to just delete it uh, you, if you are like a coder or editor you can just edit it yourself like if you want to like uh, put it for the like if you make templates yourself you can do this like uh, just write a thumbnails over here and then you can just do is uh, write this or de uh, like uh, de-encrypt it right over in this website only so okay so this is what it says now you come back to your html later uh, you don't have to delete this right now what you have to do is delete the whole script so after this script you see this closing html script tag uh, click here and at the starting of this script uh, or select all of this or maybe just you can delete this also because this is just a readable text not function so just backspace that and that is deleted right now and you just have to press save so now the file have has been saved so what i do is i go back and now i will go over my view blog and now you see it doesn't loads again and it doesn't redirects you again and bottom of there there you go you have your own custom copyright section 
so that's how we do this thing also i have edited all of these sections like in my own website like if i show you over here the same website i have made it into this one like there and say this one all of this myself so yep if you are like interested in uh, uh watching all the html stuff like you can uh, subscribe to the channel or like the video and also uh if you have any questions or suggestions or query about anything you can just comment me down i'll just help try to help you and respond to you as quickly as possible bye bye guys so yep that's how we did it bye bye